I want to give you a little tool if you are going to be spending any part of the holidays with your narcissist parent because they say the darndest things. And if you let them get to you, they're just going to up the ante. You need to look at them like they are just a small child throwing things out there to see what reaction they can get from you. And they'll literally say the most absurd things that they already know the answers to just to get to you. So understand they're doing this really on purpose. It's kind of like they're a kitten, not as cute, taking you as a ball of yarn and smacking you around. One of my girlfriends today was on the phone with her this morning and she said, hold on, I have a call from my mother. She lives with her narcissist mother. And her mother said to her, where are the bills? Did you throw them out? There was a stack of bills on the table. And she responded, yeah, I threw them out. She didn't throw them out. They're bills that have to be paid. It's a dumb question. It's designed to create conflict. Her mother stopped for a minute because she was stunned at the response and went, I knew you did that. And she was like, yeah, I gotta go. And that was it, that was all. And I'm sure that when she gets home, her narc mother will be sitting there with the bills opening them. My mother, her favorite things were to attack my ability to be a mom to my child because I did have a relationship with her up until the time my child was around five, six years old. And she would say things like, did you feed her today at four o'clock in the afternoon? As if I would starve my child all day. And I would buy into it because I was on the defensive because I was so scared to be her as a mother and she knew it. So when you are going to the, that little event now, that big event, whatever it is, and you are gonna be in the room with your narcissist parent or whoever it is, please, please don't be that ball of yarn. Just agree with them. Make a game of it. Because when you see that you are the one in control and spinning them out, it can actually be a little fun. It sounds mean, but ooh, swear jar. I can't find it. Fuck it. Seriously.